hey guys i uh got a lot of requests lately on doing a skincare routine video so that's what we're gonna do today and right now my skin isn't the greatest because i've been eating really bad so just know that diet does play a part and the more fried foods that you eat the more your skin is gonna be crappy so just consider that and and drink a lot of water that's a must right so i just want to show you all of the products that i use regular day-to-day -day basis and exactly how i use them and i'm also going to show you my everyday makeup routine all right so let's get right up into it so i want to make it clear that my skin hasn't always been the bestest that i too have a lot of skin struggles and i love fried food so i break out a lot here's inside my bathroom and here are the products that i use now i do not use them every day i do not combine them these are washes that i use once in a while now it depends on what i need the blackhead scrub is only for when i need a good deep cleaning and i usually use it on my nose area I use niacinamide, the green one, a lot when I feel my face getting dry and it just needs a little lift me up. A daily wash that I use is the green Elemis one and the JLo Beauty. I use those on a regular basis. This superfood from Elemis is amazing. I highly recommend it for sensitive skin, all skin types, honestly. This is such an affordable makeup melter. It's the Holy Hydration for Elf Skin. I'm going to take off all my makeup with this and it does a great job. It does not irritate the eyes, which I like a lot. As you can see, I can still open my eyes after using it. And the best part about all these products is that they are super affordable. And the Panoxol, I hope I'm saying that right. I use this just when I'm breaking out. Now onto my daily routine. I usually brush my eyebrows all the way up with a glue. I'm using the NYX eyebrow glue. I also use a little bit of gel just to give it an extra hold. Then I leave it there to set for a little bit and I look crazy, but it's a part of the process. While the eyebrows are setting, I go on to use my Hydra Visor, which I'm basically out of. You see me trying to get every single bit and pieces of it. I use this every single day. I cannot leave my house without it. It has sunscreen, it has the daily facial protection, and it makes my skin glow right away. So don't think I'm all out. I have another backup right here, okay? Can't live without it. So after the daily moisturizer, I use my Fenty Skin Flash Nap. Now this just gives you an extra wake up eye look. I suffer with dark circles, so this is a must. I wanted to show you really quickly what one eye looks like with it and one eye looks like without it. Just to see if you can notice a difference for yourself. But if you notice, I'm very gentle with the skin, right? You don't want to be rough on anything on your skin because the face is so sensitive. Even when putting on makeup, you want to dab, 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 nice and soft. Like I said before, I suffer with dark circles, so I I like to use concealer on a daily basis here i'm using the tarte shape tape i grab my beauty blender and i wet it i just put it under water squeeze out all the excess water and then i start blending keep in mind the longer you blend the softer you blend the better it'll look i wanted to get you a close-up so you can see how it's going after the concealer i like to go in with my telescope l'oreal mascara this is one of my favorite mascaras i'm on my fourth one now it has such a long stick and it really separates the lashes that's what i really like about it it rarely ever clumps this is a really good mascara if you haven't tried it before i really really suggest it close up so we're going back in with the nyx eyebrow glue to fix up these brows because they're not going to stay pushed up all day after they have set and stayed up for a while i now brushed them to the desired look but there you have it guys that's my daily makeup routine just some mascara some concealer some eyebrow pencil definitely the fancy skin that's a must-have hope you enjoyed this video and that it was very informative please let me know if you will have any other questions please comment a lipstick emoji so that i know you made it to the end of the video i'll see you in the next one love you bye